hello good morning welcome back to my channel i know i said the next time you saw me was going to be like my moving vlog and my room tour but um the room's not actually finished yet because we've hit in like a few curveballs i can't actually film the room tour yet but i will do soon so today is actually going to be like a bit of a vloggy day but also like just a really really big moment in my recovery and also there's something else happening which is a nice little moment in my life if you're new here i'm bro and i struggled with anorexia for about five years and i'm now in recovery and have been in recovery for like a year i've done like all the physical work so i've got myself to like a healthy body i'm just working on my thoughts towards food and myself and eating generally but today i'm going to be doing something that i genuinely haven't done in like the whole time i was struggling so like five years um and i'm not saying that to like make people feel competitive or like bad if they have because like everyone struggles differently it was something that i was scared of and i know other people that were not scared of that and just did it because it didn't scare them or like as soon as they went into recovery they did it whatever so i'm not saying it for that reason but it's just obviously a big deal for me because i haven't done this in like five years so if i <laughs> seem like anxious about it that would be why i'm gonna eat mcdonald's i'm gonna go to mcdonald's and i'm gonna eat mcdonald's I'm really 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 anxious about it. I'm really nervous. I've been putting this off for so long Like my boyfriend my friends have just been like I want you to come get them at plant Like you need to come get them at plant and I've just been like I can't do it I can't do it which is obviously just me holding on to an anorexic thought and rule so I'm not doing that anymore So today I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna break that and then well actually before that I'm getting a hamster. I'm getting a new pet a little hamster because obviously I I've moved out and my dog B is my parents dog So I couldn't bring her. I'm getting myself something small and fluffy to get me through the day I also just want to say that these charity hoodies and t-shirts are still available and will be for the next I'll put the time on the screen here because I know the time between me filming and editing is going to be different 40% of all profits is going to beat the UK's eating disorder charity <coughs> I don't know what's wrong with my voice this morning but it's just not working the hoodies come in four different colours and the t-shirts do too so you should go check them out I'll put the link in the description and they're available internationally so wherever you are you can grab one anyways I didn't think I'd be a hamster pair. Yeah. No. I can see him in there. He's trying to get out of the little hole. He's so cute. Actually, making me drop your bed in. But he's out. He's out. He's out. No, that's where his little house. Okay, let me go in. Let me go in. Face first. Hodge, listen in. She's mother. This is why he needs a lot more. Okay, hi. So I know I was saying like about his cage and I said at the start like he needs more space to burrow and I did know that. So we have ordered him like a big tank, like a big aquarium kind of tank that we're going to fill so he can burrow. This is not a permanent cage, it's a temporary cage. Back on with the video. Can we get a medium plant meal please? One more drink? Uh, Sprite Zero. Sprite zero. I don't get wrong. No, it's just a command. Ugh, I want to... It's fine. It is fine. It's fine. Okay. Oh. oh my god, Jesus Christ. This looks real interesting. Oh my god, I'm literally shitting myself. I'm so nervous. It's not big of a deal. Pick the bad I'm doing it. It's fine. You ready? Okay. Ten okay. fight at the same time? Yeah, okay, cool. Let's go. Yeah? One, two, three? Okay. You go first. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh my god. I've never actually eaten a McDonald's burger. This one's a good McDonald's burger. Oh my god. Do a good job. Thank you. Here you go. Uh-huh. Oh my god. This feels like the first time I was facing my fear foods like all over again. I don't even know why I big this up so much in my head. It's literally, it's fine. Okay. Say goodbye. Is that good food? I haven't been this anxious about food in like months. It's actually just food, like it's just another form of food. We've already eaten burgers. I know. This is how like irrational anorexia is though. Like in my head it's like the word McDonald's and I'm like, whoa. It's literally fine. I've eaten burgers, it's the fact it's McDonald's is what I'm saying. I don't get that though, it makes no sense. I think it's the association between McDonald's and unhealthy. Mm-hmm. Which is bullshit. Mm -hmm. But that's why you need to challenge it. I really want to just be able to like go out with you guys and just like get a mcdonald's or like just like you said if we were like on some road trip or something you stop at a service station and i'm there like i can only get like a mns meal deal like it's just a bit bit rubbish really it's literally fine it's literally fine it's literally fine how does the burger actually taste it's really nice i genuinely i haven't eaten any of the chips wait i'll take a bite and then i'll eat a chip i'm gonna try chip a fry the pull in the box they're just really average chips. They're quite underwhelming. Mm -hmm. They're tasty. In, in my head, they were like so much better when I was younger. They're literally cold for me. The burgers are all nice though. Mm-hmm. I don't think I'd like vegan cheese. We're not going vegan. 
no going vegan for me would be a bad idea we will cut out a lot of things that i like which is why i want to do it because i only just got them back they are nice actually and this is so much easier now i've started doing it as well mm -hmm. picked it up so much in my head but for what <laughs> why i'm trying to get you to do this for months oh months and months mm -hmm. It's actually so good. Mm -hmm. Food freedom. <laughs> what are you doing there? Thank you. Ella's been like begging for this moment. Don't think, just do. I seem so stupid right now. It doesn't. It's a big deal, but it's not a big deal at the same time. Yeah, I've never ever eaten a beef burger from McDonald's before, so I don't even know what they tasted like. This is kind of freakily like meat though, like as I remember meat. There's no beyond though. Yeah, so it's it's meant to be, mm. obviously it's meant to taste like meat, but like it's weird how like accurate it is. Mm. I'm nearly there. Mm -hmm. It's my last bite. I ate them at plant. Yeah, baby. I finished them at plant. I'm gonna eat the like below average chips just cause food, but like I'm buzzing right now. I just did that. I've avoided that for so long. I don't know why. Stupid. And I can just do it, like, carry on doing it. These chips are quite disappointing, and I've said that like four times, but... It is. Also, it is an absolute tip in here, but it's because we just renovated the room. We've seen renovated. We, no, well, what's like the word for it? Decor decorated. I forgot that was a word. To be fair, these aren't even that bad now. We've done that same cycle twice. Mm -hmm. Very bad average, these aren't that bad. I have two brain cells, what do you expect? Mm -hmm. Up the vegans. I'm gonna finish these chips, these fries, whatever, my drink, but I did it. <clears throat> I'm actually really proud of myself right now. Something I didn't think I'd do. And I did it. Woo! See you later. Today's been a really like nice but also quite overwhelming and anxious day for me. Um I've got something stuck. <laughs> I don't know why, I've just felt like on the verge of tears like a lot recently. It's kinda why I took a bit of a break from YouTube between November, December, January. Just because I've been in quite like a low place and a bit of a pit really and I'm trying to get myself out of it. I think I'm just finding myself quite overwhelmed a lot of the time and obviously my fear foods don't really impact me that much anymore but today I faced one that I think I kind of didn't ever think I'd face. I don't know I've said that about probably all of them <laughs> But like McDonald's was something that in my head was always like, that's so unhealthy. I'll never eat that. It's not unhealthy. It would sure not be good for you if you ate three meals, three snacks every day. There's lines, but anything that benefits your mental health is healthy. And obviously it sounds a bit weird, but eating McDonald's is going to really help my brain because I'm going to learn that it's okay. So, you know, I think I'm getting a lot of anxiety about failing at things. And I think part of the thing that I couldn't get over was that i felt like i was making bad videos and i felt like i wasn't doing well enough and i felt like i wasn't uploading regularly enough and it kind of got to me and then i just didn't really want to carry on putting myself under that much pressure so i stopped for a bit but now i want to like keep doing it and maybe make like a regular upload schedule so like every sunday i think i'm gonna really try and do that it might help me food wise i've been doing really well i've had a lot of like guilt recently and just thoughts about not deserving food which i'm like the biggest advocate for saying that everyone deserves food so it makes no sense but i think just generally my like depression and the other thing that i have going on which I, it must be really annoying me always saying like i don't want to talk about it but like it's very very personal and i think if i shared it on the internet i'd get a lot of questions or a lot of assumptions and it would make me really uncomfortable so i just don't share it but um this is just a reminder to you that you genuinely deserve to eat anything you want no matter what society says about it no matter what your brain says about it you deserve to eat it you should eat it and if it scares you then you should definitely challenge that fear because the only thing that's going to come from eating scary foods is more life freedom that's it that's all nothing more nothing less nothing bad is going to happen the world's not going to end you always deserve to eat the foods that are going to make you happy even if they make you anxious to start with in the long run they're going to bring you happiness i think it's just about remembering that you're human and no mistake you could make or 
the way you feel about your body is ever going to mean that you don't deserve to eat. Food is just fuel and you need it to keep yourself alive. And trust me, there are always going to be people that want you alive. And I'm just really, really proud of myself about McDonald's. Like, I feel a little bit guilty, but also just generally really good. So, my boyfriend is currently downstairs making me some noodles because I just really want something comforting and like easy to eat and I think after that I'm gonna have a fruit salad and some yogurt maybe. I do just want to make it very clear that I have not shown everything I've eaten today obviously. It's been a very like on the go needing to just grab something quickly day. I have still eaten enough obviously. I will also be snacking tonight so we are leaving him alone. Yeah, um, but there he is, he's a very beautiful boy. I have my noodles. I'm really tired and really hungry. <laughs> I'm sorry that the background's a mess. Um, this bright coat is really contrasted. I'm so hungry. Food is good, I like food. That was very lovely. Thank you. It was like exactly what I wanted. I think I'm gonna get some fruit and a yogurt. Oh, but you want me to try your egg fried rice? I've never tried it. It's gonna be really, really hot. Yeah, I'll blow it a little bit. I'm not sure how hot it will actually be. I'll just blow it onto the table. Good job. I don't know. I don't know. Like it? Yeah. I always choose noodles over that probably. I have not drunk enough today. Never mind. Oh, it's because we've been like kind of busy. When I do anything, it feels like a lot for my brain. You've been busy. We've been busy. Yeah, I, I've been anxious though because of what I've done thank you obviously having like a snacky dinner so i've got an apple a cherry yogurt and some mini eggs i have actually done really well today you have i think like it kind of took me back like how much i had been avoiding mcdonald's which was <laughs> so funny but so stupid like thought i didn't have anything that like would actually make me anxious but then i'll sat there like nearly crying over a fucking mcdonald's Uh, we're about to go on a walk. Should we bring no, we're not bringing our hamster we've had for one day on a walk. Oh, it's so bright. My snack, I'm having some biscuits, a cup of tea, and a banana. I wish you had a really good day. Have you had a good day? I had a really nice day. It's been a very good day. Mm -hmm. We acquired a son. I'm all good. I need to keep remembering that no matter what and no matter how I feel, I just need to eat and I deserve food. My brain's been going a bit whack recently. Don't know why, it just has. But those are the times where you have to be the strongest. These are really good bananas. That's my really cute mug that says, you are so loved. What does mine say? Yours says, fuck, fuck, fuck. Biscuit, I'm gonna continue to snack and then sleep. So I'm gonna end the video here. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Um, also a reminder, as I think I said at the start of the video, the t-shirts and hoodies that I have designed for Beat fundraising, Beat the UK's eating disorder charity, are still available and I will leave the link in the description. I'll also leave my Instagram linked in the description if you wanna go follow me on there. I'm really, really tired. I'll love you and leave you and good night.